Hi, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel, whichever. This is episode two of the Better Minecraft series. If you enjoyed the last one, or if you haven't watched the last one, please go watch the last one, otherwise you're not going to know what's going on. So, the first thing I did was name some of the axolotls I had found in the previous episode to some subscribers that I had noticed were in my notification. Or the names, yep. So I had Brit, Shelby, Jack, Richard, and Ruby. So thank you for subscribing. Much appreciated. And the pond is very temporary. It's just so they don't crawl out and die. And a little after that, I had decided to plant my dragon. I'm thinking about naming it Elsa. I think that's a great name for a fire dragon. What do you think? Like, I think it's great. And a little after that, I had went mining. Because I had wanted to build a house, and I had wanted the roof to be out of amethyst because I am predictable and really, really, really like this block to an unhealthy amount. But that is okay. <laughs> we all like things. And amethyst is just a strange little fas- Okay. Okay, not a fascination, it's an obsession. I'll, I'll admit it. It's a little- it's a little concerning. So, this took about ten minutes to strip, so I'm not gonna make you watch the whole thing. And I hate doing time lapses. And then immediately gets into a, slow, a small time lapse of just getting some iron and some coal and probably some other things. But that is okay. And when I had come home... Elsa the dragon had hatched. Sorry, Elsa the fire dragon. The fire- Elsa the fire dragon had hatched. But I was not expecting it. I thought it takes 40 minutes to hatch, but no, I think it takes like 10. And the dragon had almost grown up. And I was not prepared. Although, I'm never prepared. So I had to find fish. For some reason I always go for bones, but I did find fish eventually. So after that, after finding the fish, the dragon had gone a wall up on a tree. That is annoying, but that is okay. Because I love this dragon. I love my dragons, plural. I have two of them now. And after taming the dragon, I had to get wood. Not too long after that, I had started building the frame to my house, which this house turned out great. As you can see, it's in the thumbnail. It turned out awesome. I don't think it could have turned out better. But this house really was trust the process. It was a bit, um, a little bit scuffed at the start of the building process. It, it just really wasn't it, but that is okay. It's, it was very trust the process. After a little bit of time building this very strange house that looked a bit ugly, like not a bit ugly, it looked very ugly, I had decided that I would need dark oak wood. It's fine, I had only spent like an hour collecting spruce wood, but that's fine. I jumped on Boo for probably the third or second time, I'm not going to say it was the first time, but the cinematic effect will say it was the first time. But I couldn't find the dark oak. I found it, but I couldn't find it easily. For some reason, it was hard to find. It's not even that hard of a wood to find, but that's fine. I had found avocados and this really cool, like, pink wood. Well, you'd think it's purple, but it's pink. Anyway, it's not important. See, it's pink. Isn't that cool? I put that in the house. And Then I flew over this like, I, I can't think of the place, but there were some really cool landscapes and a dragon, a, a dead dragon. Why doesn't mine grow that big? <laughs> but I had, I had found a, um, a mushroom island, but not, not the spruce, not the spruce, not the dark oak wood, which I was after. A and then I had found it. Never mind. Just don't listen to me, it's fine. 
and had mined it, but had, my axe had broken before I could get enough saplings to get, like, yeah. So eventually I would have to make a wood axe, which was quite painful to the ego. Since I didn't bring my pickaxe, because that's smart. Who doesn't bring a pickaxe when they're doing it? Just, that is stupid. Anyways. So after... My ego took a bruise after having to make a wooden axe. And after collecting enough dark oak saplings, I had flown home. Flown home. But in the journey home, I had found this temple, which had another dragon egg in it. But it was a fire dragon egg. So that's unfortunate. And I got blessed with this sunbird. I don't know how to feel about that. And found this pretty um, intimidating place. But I'll probably save that for another day, because my inventory is full. After an hour of flying, I had finally gotten home. It really seemed like a lot of effort for one sapling. Well, a couple saplings. But it's fine, I've got it now. Just because it took like two hours, it's fine. And I had used these pink this pink wood, I forget what it's called, and I cannot pronounce what it's called. But I thought it looked good. I don't know. You, you'll, I think it's that wood that you either love or hate. I personally love it, but that's just my opinion, and that's alright. But I think it really pulled the house together because it gave it a different colour other than brown. And I know it still looks weird, but that's okay. And I had used the driftwood as well. I think it looked really good. And I had put pine floors in. I had made this decision a while ago and some dark oak and I just done a very basic wood a basic wood a basic roof I can speak honest but it turned out very good like I love how this house turned out as much as I was quite um, anxious about how it was going to turn out because I really didn't want to have to start the house again because it was ugly it was starting to come along I just added some leaves on the roof because that's my secret to everything. But these purple leaves, I was thinking of a different purple leaf because they have a lighter one, but I didn't want to have to get on my dragon to go find it again. That might be another thing. But personally, I think this looked great after doing some gardening that I'm not going to add into the video because I'm lazy. But apparently if you put the dragon egg near certain blocks, it will change. And I wanted a forest dragon. So apparently if you put it near the green leaves, it's going to turn green. Anyways, I'll see how it goes. If you liked the video, subscribe. It really helps. Anyways, goodbye.